Previously, Abby was forced to go on a field trip with the school, and thanks to assigned seating, she had to sit next to Heath on the bus. Things got heated when Abby threw Heath's phone out of the bus window after a fight, and Heath caused trouble when he stopped the bus to retrieve his phone. But now, the bus is back on schedule and headed towards the field trip destination. La la! I almost forgot how fabulous I look today! Heath, keep it down over there unless you want me to throw that mirror out the window like I did with your phone! Ugh! Whatever! Why do you have to be such a buzzkill? Oh, excuse me, can we stop somewhere soon? I have to go to the bathroom! Sorry, Jackson, we don't have time to stop anywhere. We're already way behind schedule. Oh no, but I really have to go! Hey bro, it sounds like you could use a distraction, and luckily, I have the perfect one! I think it's about time you met my little buddy! Is that a spider? Yup, and not just any spider. This little guy is a very rare Microhepsera Montivaga, also known as a Spruce Fur Moth Spider. His name is Pepper, and even though I have a hefty bug collection, he's my all-time favorite fella! Oh my god- <laughs> I hate spiders! Get that out of here! Gil? Why on earth would you bring your pet spider on a school field trip? Well, the spruce fur moth spider is actually an endangered species, so I kinda gotta keep a close eye on this little guy at all times and make sure he's doing good. Oh, I'm kinda scared of spiders. Is he poisonous? Nah, Pepper is super friendly. Why don't I show you? Gil, I swear if you let that spider out on this freaking bus, I will lose it! Here, Pepper Pepper, come on out and play with Daddy! Don't be shy, little buddy! Oh, there you are, Pepper! Look at him go! Oh my god, please just tell me you did not let a giant spider out on the bus! Whoa! Oh, I think he likes you, bro! Hey, that kind of tickles! Ah, that tickles! Ah! Pepper! Ah! I hate spiders! Well, that takes care of it! Pepper, no! How could you? <laughs> yeah, maybe next time don't bring your beloved pet spider on a school field trip. Do you have any idea what you've just done? The spruce for moth spider is an endangered species! Pepper was one of the last ones left in the whole world! Well, now he's gone, so get over it, okay? Oh, I'm gonna have to scrub him off the bottom of my shoe tonight. Great! <laughs> Oh no, we're almost out of gas. Well, Jackson, you're in luck, because we're gonna have to stop at a gas station after all. Oh, yay! That was a good distraction, Gil! I forgot I even had to go to the bathroom! All right, everyone, we're here. I'm gonna get gas, and if anyone needs to go inside, they can, but just make it quick. <sighs> Oh, I must have fallen asleep. Hey, where are we? We're stopped at a gas station. Do you want to go inside? I think I'll stay here. I'm so tired, I just want to get back to sleep. Okay, I'll be right back. Ugh, I need to go get some fresh air away from all you freaks. <sighs> Okay, is everyone ready to get back on the road? Well, Jackson is not back yet, but I actually don't care, so yep, we're all here! Ah! Wait, guys, you forgot about me! Oh no, come back! Oh... Good nap. Hey Jackie, I'm gonna have a snack. Do you want some? 
Jackson? Um, guys, where's Jackie? He's not in his seat. Oh my god, I left a student at a gas station. <laughs> OMG, Jackie, I can't believe we left you here. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Some guy in a white van offered to give me a ride home, but my mama warned me about stranger danger, so I said no, ran inside and cried in the bathroom. But I'm all good now. Thank goodness you're okay. You're so smart and brave. Jackson, I am so sorry this happened to you. Never in my 12 years of teaching have I left a student in a gas station. Listen, you're not gonna threaten the school with a lawsuit over this, right? What's a lawsuit? Okay, well, it looks like I saved the school from some legal trouble then. All right, if everyone's okay, let's get back on the bus and keep traveling. Okay, everyone, I think it'd be best if we all pretended that didn't just happen. Now let's get back on the road. Hey, bro. Sorry I didn't notice you were still in the gas station. I was in my fields and totally zoned out. Oh, it's okay. Okay, everyone, we're finally here. Get ready to do some community service. I can't believe we came all this way just to do volunteer work. Ugh. Okay, guys, we're volunteering at the soup kitchen today, and we're a little late, so we need to hurry and go inside to start our shifts. This is going to be a really rewarding experience, and I'm so glad that you guys all came along to give back to the community. Well, I, for one, cannot wait to help out at the soup kitchen. There is nothing better than volunteering. Okay, everyone, nice work so far. You've definitely earned your lunch break. Although, Heath, one note, I would appreciate it if you stopped showing off your designer clothes. We're at a soup kitchen, not a fashion show. It's just rude. Ugh, whatever! All right, now you guys can eat your lunch out here, or you can go back on the bus to eat. Ugh, I can't believe we're not even done volunteering yet! This is the worst trip ever! Seriously, how dare they overwork me like this? I've already put in my hours, like, why can't I just get out of here now? For once, I actually agree with you. You know what? I'm gonna get us out of here. Buckle your seatbelts, people. It's gonna be a wild ride. Um, Abby, what are you doing? You're going to have to trust me, Frankie. Now hold on tight. Oh, this isn't good. Yes, it is. Get me out of here. What the? Hey, stop. What do you think you're doing? Ah! Oh my god. Get back here now! Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Woohoo! Abby is free! Oh boy, this is really not good. 